come to the quiz show where if you know, you know, and if you don't, we confirm it. <laughs> Kakaribu na dictionary, kakaribu na encyclopedia, chukua notebook, kalamu. Buda nataka kujua kama wewe pia unaweza kujibu maswali from the comfort of your home. Leo tunauliza na wewe pia una tweet. Moto kama pasi, Aspa K. I'm your host Buda Boss. Wacha leo tukapeleke kakiendanga. In the meantime, let's discover who our contestants are. <laughs> Madam, what's your name and what do you do? I'm Nancy Juguna. Nancy Juguna, eh? Yes. Self employed. Self employed? Yes. So, so far, you have to be self employed. <laughs> Any particular business line? You no, I'm just a hustler. You're a hustler? Yeah. That's good. Can you say Nancy? All the best. Thank Sir, you. Yes. what's your name and what do you do? I'm Nelson Commander. Nelson Commander? Hey, I'm out of the Prize Studio. This is your man. Anyway, Nelson! What? You have to go to the Nelson, what do you do? Uh, currently, uh, I work with an insurance company. All right. Yeah, and I'm also an entrepreneur. Entrepreneur? How? Shaf kidi wa fanya kama modeling nini? Bado. Bado. Uzi fikiri ya. Okay. He team ni ito aji. A team Avengers. Team Avengers. Fantastic. That is Nelson and Nancy. Team Avengers. Over to this side, sir. What's your name and what do you do? Um, Kabisa Justin. Hey. Kabisa ni jinaake ukweli. Kabisa, kabisa. <laughs> Completely. <laughs> wow, Kabisa, what do you do? Electrical engineer. Hey, shh. Electrical engineer in the house. Yes, sir. Moto kama pasi, napenda yo. Madam, what's your name and what do you do? Wangare Njuguna. Yes, Wangare. And I'm a hustler. And a hustler. Hey, <laughs> Leoni, hustler versus hustler. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Wangare and Kabisa. Hit him in it, was it? Team Kabisa. Team Kabisa! <laughs> Tell in Shafurai, Nishafurai, Team Kabisa versus the Avengers. Who's gonna carry the day? Leo to Nauliza Ukijibu, Twende Kiendanga. As Pake, we begin with a quick fire trivia, and our first challenge is a general knowledge, after which we shall be able to go to the second round where the team members will have an opportunity of choosing between history, sport, or entertainment. First things first, general knowledge, and I feel like I should start with Kabisa. Hapo sawa. Wote ni zinawe kabisa. Hapa kumbuka we cannot discuss kila mtu anapambana na hali yake. But if you don't know the answer. Unasema nini? Pass. Pass kabisa. I'll see you. <laughs> okay kabisa we begin with you. If you are ready, so am I. Time begins now. How many hearts does an octopus have? Hearts sir. How many hearts does an octopus have? One. What? Incorrect! The Social Network is a film about the founding of which major website? Pass, alright. What is the capital city of Namibia? Time is ticking. Antananarivo. Incorrect! Helsinki is the capital city of Finland. In which movie was the name Helsinki given to a character? Highest money, highest. Correct! How many elements are in the periodic table? 42. Incorrect! Where is the smallest bone in the human body located? Fingers. Fingers. Incorrect. Which two planets lack moons? Time is ticking. If you don't know, say pass. Time. Time. It's ticking. Pass. pass. All right. What year did the first Apple iPhone launch? Pass. The current richest man in the world, Jeff Bezos, is CEO and president of which online retailer? Amazon. Correct. Which do you... Oh my. Oh my. Time is up. Time is up. Time is up. Hey, Mumejaribu. What is the capital city of Namibia? It is Windhoek. Windhoek. The social network is a film about the founding of Facebook. And then how many hearts does an octopus have? Three. Not one. <laughs> now you know my brother. <laughs> the two planets that lack moons, it is Mercury and Venus. And of course, the first Apple iPhone was launched in 2007. You have gotten two questions correct. If I am correct, that makes it 200 points. Kabisa. Kabisa. Kabisa, Otwangu. Kabisa. Nelson. Nelson, Nelson, Nancy. Ladies first. Ladies first. You're in wisdom. 
Na, Nancy, umerushwa chini ya basi ya subuhi na mapema. Are you ready? Yes. I love it. Time begins now. What does a Geiger counter measure? Temperature, gravity, radiation or weather? Weather. Incorrect. What does LG stand for in LG Electronics? Let's go. Incorrect. Why which social media app only lets you view pictures and messages for a limited time? Incorrect. Levi Strauss is best known for manufacturing what kind of clothing? Uh, uh, Strauss. Correct. What color is found on 75% of the world's flags? Red. Correct. What does the Japanese sumimasen translate to in English? False. All right. State whether true or false. Flying in an aeroplane is statistically safer than driving in a car. False. False. Incorrect. What is the name of the biggest part of the human brain? Medulla. Incorrect. Which smoked fish might you expect to be served with cream cheese and lemon juice in canapes? Tilapia. Incorrect. What is the tiny piece at the end of a shoeless cold? <laughs> Less. <laughs> <laughs> it is called less. I like you. I like this guy. Incorrect. The correct answer is it's an aglet. Yeah, yeah. I I mean, I'm about to be at the national level. I'm coming. Me na joga kaka kitu kani tegeni zoka kitu kaka wax. Did plastic ni wax. Now it is called an aglet. Now we know the biggest part of the human brain is the cerebrum. And of course, the kind of smoked fish that you might expect to be served with ice cream cheese, not ice cream, cream cheese and lemon juice and uh, with some canapes, it is salmon, not tilapia. Sumimasen in Japanese means, excuse me, <laughs> uh, LG stands for Lucky Gold Star. And finally, a Geiger counter measures radiation. You have gotten the, 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 the one. Two questions correct. You are at 200 points. But they expected you to get Snapchat. Give me Snapchat. <laughs> okay, Snapchat. To go in. But <laughs> 200 points apiece. My goodness. To me answer with a tie. So because I began with the team Kabisa, allow me this time round to begin with the Avengers. Hapo vipi? Hapo History. Entertainment. Sports. Tunakufa na ga. Discuss agree. Two seconds. Entertainment. Napenda yo. Nelson. Nianza na wewe sasa. Entertainment. Are you ready? Yes. Alright. Wembe ni ule ule. You can't discuss. If you don't know, say pass. Time begins now. Kodoza Calvin Brothers Jr. Is the birth name of which US rapper known for hit singles Gin and Juice and Drop It Like It's Hot? You don't know, say pass. Nelly. Incorrect. Who sang the song Jiggy Jiggy? Correct. What film did Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt famously meet on the set of? Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Correct. Finish the lyrics. Baby Shark. <laughs> Correct. On the television show, How I Met Your Mother, what is Lily's occupation? If you don't know, say pass. pass. Time is ticking. Correct. Good choice. What is the name of Teacher Wanjiko's husband? Pass. pass. What is the name of Mickey Mouse's girlfriend? Minnie Mouse. Correct. Which Kenyan journalist attributed with the word smoking wrote the book Through My African Eyes? Wait, 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 wait. Which Kenyan journalist attributed with the word smoking wrote the book through my African eyes? Pass. Pass. All right, time is up. Say it, brother. Jeff Koinange. Jeff Koinange. Hasara ni hapa kuna kudiscuss. Wano na kufa na aliyao. Godoza Calvin Brothers. Wano ni Snoop Dogg. Hata bibi ni janga. Hii jamani ni paenyea. Kuna jina mzaza kikupea na zimu utafute nikini. Hahaha. Hey, God, hey, Kodoza. Yo jina ni ya <coughs> Alright, on the television show, How I Met Your Mother, what is Lily's occupation? It is kindergarten teacher. The husband of teacher Wanjiko is Victor Bear. Victor Bear. 
And of course, uh, which one? Oh, hey, we've got one, two, three, four, five actually. Five. I got my part of five. Willie Paul, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, do 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 do. Minnie Mouse. Oh, Jeff Koenange, I it was after. Yes, you are correct. You guys have gotten four questions correct. The Avengers are now officially at 600 points. Unakuja ni moona sana. Kabisa. Yes, sir. Wangare. Sports. History. Gun. You can discuss and agree. <laughs> Hey, which one? History. History. Excellent choice. Excellent choice. Hata mimi ningechagua history. Are you ready? <laughs> Time begins now. According to Greek mythology, who was the first woman on earth? If incorrect, which African country was formerly known as Abyssinia? Ethiopia. Correct. What is the world's biggest island? Madagascar, incorrect. Which country is known as the land of white elephant? Time South is ticking. Africa. Sorry? South Africa. Incorrect. Which country produces the most coffee in the world? Ethiopia. Incorrect. What were the British trying to explore when they colonized Uganda? The source of River Nile. Correct. The revolution and improvements in the agricultural field in the ancient times was called? Yes, 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 yes. Tell me. Pass. Pass. Okay. Where did maize originate from? U.S. Incorrect. The first animal to be domesticated was a dog. Correct. Who is the cabinet secretary of devolution? My guru. My guru. <laughs> wow. Okay, Kabisa. Yeah. It is not my guru. Correct answer is Honorable Eugene Wamanwa. <laughs> the first animal to be domesticated is a dog. Maize originated in Mexico. And then uh, the country that produces most coffee is Brazil. The land of white elephants is referred also to Thailand as Thailand, 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 Thailand. Okay, the biggest island in the world is Greenland Island. And which one? According to Greek mythology, the first woman on earth was Pandora. Yeah, and of course, he led to the Africa, the revolution and improvements in agricultural field in the ancient times was called? Agrarian revolution. Correct! Agrarian revolution! Lakini kila mtu na pambana na hali yake. Poleni sana kuzaguni. You guys have gotten how many questions correct? Three questions correct. 300 additional points. You are now officially at 500 points. This is going to be a tight race like none we've seen before. Maybe we have. I don't know. You tell me, is it going to be Team Kabisa for you or is it going to be the Avengers? Let's find out to Kisonga Mbele to our next challenge of two toots. Voila! <laughs> this is the quiz show and we are on to our challenge of two truths and one lie. We are going to read out three statements, two of which are true. One is false. Can they prove themselves as human lie detectors? That's the big cue. So far, our leaders, the Avengers at 600 points, only 100 points away from Team Kabisa who are at 500 points. They will get an opportunity of going first. Hapa Moneza could discuss and you tell me your team answer. Mdam Takua Naya could discuss is nothing more than five seconds of BD. Your first statement reads as follows Charlie Chaplin came first in a Charlie Chaplin lookalike contest. True or false? Statement number two The first tea bags were made of silk. True or false? Statement number three. The Statue of Liberty was a gift from France. True or false? Time is ticking. Nancy, I would like to hear from you on behalf of the team. Which one is the false statement? Is it one? Is it two? 
Or is it three? One. One is incorrect. Yes. Why do you think one is incorrect? Because you've never seen the other look alike. You've <laughs> 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 You've never done what? <laughs> You've never seen the other look alike. <laughs> you have never seen the other look alike. So we make them because So now, so in your wisdom, I mean, I believe you can make it. I show no cause of wisdom. I just can. Because I'm okay. I just can. When you got a wisdom, you have come. Tea bag, ya kwanza. Ilikuwa ya silk. Tea bag. The first tea bag. Eh, hey, silk. Unaweza kwa chai alafu sasa iko ndani ya silk. Ehe, alafu unatoa. Unatoa? Si ni tea bag. Unatoa ndio upige pita. Si <laughs> silk. 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 Nguo. Ni sawa. Ningewapatia chance ya ku change lakini it's too late. Polen. Mhm. Nancy, najua ndio ya ku change. Ah ah. Nelson. Amekata. Amekata. <laughs> lakini unge change ungesema nini? <laughs> Ninge maintain tu hapo chaji. Unge maintain hapo? Yeah. Sawa. Hata mimi ninge maintain na this position. Statement number 3 is true. Statement number 2 is also true. The fourth statement is statement number 1. Mimi ponea chupu chupu hapo. One hundred additional points. You guys are now at 700. Can you guys make this 600 points? I believe you can. Your statements read as follows. The currency of France is the franc. Statement number 2. Ben Nevis is the tallest mountain in the UK. Statement number 3. Cyclones spin in a clockwise di- direction in the southern hemisphere. Is it statement 1, 2 or 3? You can discuss and give me your team answer. Wangare would love to hear from you on this one on behalf of the team. You have 5 seconds to discuss already you're at 4 seconds. Is it statement number 1 the currency of France is the franc? Is it statement number 2 Ben Nevis is the tallest mountain in the UK or is it statement number 3 cyclone spin in a clockwise direction in the southern hemisphere? Talk to me Wangare. Sad. Statement number 3 is false. All right? Yes, I like sir. it. I like it. So the currency of France is franc. True. True. Yes. I like the confidence. Ben Nevis is the tallest mountain in the UK. True. True. Yes. Cyclones spin in a clockwise direction you pussy. False. Zuna spinning anti clockwise. Yes sir. Anti clockwise. Mm. Good job. Thank you guy. Eh kwambie when you mjanges. Hapa. Correct. Okay. Ben Nevis is the tallest mountain in the UK. That is true. Cyclone spin in a clockwise direction in the southern hemisphere. That is true. The false statement is statement number one. The currency of France is the franc. It used to be. In 2002 they changed and now the uh, currency is what? The euro. <laughs> wow. Okay. So close. So close, so close. You missed a point on that one. The Avengers are at 700 points, and we have Team Kabisa at 500 points. But young, I na nibamba. Hey, do you na nibamba? Na kuno maji ni kikao. Short commercial break. Welcome back to the quiz show where if you know, you know and if you don't, we confirm it. We have a tight race so far. We have covered the quick fire trivia. We have also covered two truths and one lie. And our leader so far are the Avengers to my left, leading at 700 points and close on their heels is Team Kabisa, led by Kabisa himself. <laughs> at 500 points, wacha tuone watapambana vipi when it come to our next challenge which is guess the meaning of the word. We are going to read out a word and we expect them to tell us the correct synonym out of the four options we are going to give them. Here you can discuss and you also have an opportunity of grabbing or snatching a point if somebody gets the question incorrect. Sawa sawa. Mhm. Musilale mutapitwa mukilala. 
Sawa mm. Haya your first word is modicum. Modicum. Options are as follows. A. Whole. B. Caustic. C. Broke. D. Iota. Is it A, B, C or D? Modicum. You can discuss and tell me your team answer Nelson. I'd love to hear from you on this one. Is it A, B, C or D? Whole, caustic, brogue, iota. Talk to me. Uh, we'll go with uh, whole, A. You will go with whole, A. I like it. Makes sense to me. Incorrect. You guys can snatch 100 points. Nisikia utoka kwako kabisa. Is it A, B, C or D? Niambie kitu inakaa. Niambie. Niambie. Caustic. Caustic yenyewe inakaa. Yenyewe inakaa for real. Yenyewe caustic na modicum. I mean Incorrect. Correct answer is D. Ayona. <laughs> 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 Over to you. Can you guys get 100 points? I believe it is possible. Your word is bundogle. Bundogle. A. Fraud. B. Fiasco. C. Epitome. D. Charisma. Time is ticking. Wangare want to hear from you on this one on behalf of the team. Is it A, B, C or D? Fraud. Fraud! You sure? Yes. For real? Yes. Don't change your answer. No. No. Fraud. I like it. Correct. A hundred points. <laughs> Six hundred points for Team Kabisa. Only a hundred points apart. Can you guys make this eight hundred points? I believe it's possible. Your word is nuance. Nuance. Options are A. Lot. B. Distinction. C. Glib. D. Mantra. 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 Which one comes extremely close to what we are looking for? Nancy, I would like to hear from you on behalf of the team. Is it lot? Is it distinction? Is it clip? Is it mantra? Tony Nancy. Uh-huh. Uh, mantra. Mantra! Beautiful. Just in case they are wrong. Just in case. What would you say? Glib. Glib! You are wrong. That is incorrect. Good job, Nancy. But you're also incorrect. The correct <laughs> answer is B. I think it's Ungi Namago. I think it's Ungi Namago. I think it's Ungi Namago. I think it's Ungi But anyway, it is what it is. It is what it is. Over to you. Your word is predilection. 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 Options are A, disinterest, B, oblivion, C, revel, D, fondness. Fondness. Is it A, B, C, or D? Kabisa ningependa kusikia kutoka kwako on this one. A, B, C, or D? Uko zero. <laughs> Kabisa, give me your answer. The Latino language. Turn the cards. Three, two, one disinterest. Disinterest. At least you must kitu. I like it. Just in case, Nelson. Just in case they may be wrong. What will be your answer? Oblivion. Oblivion. Good news for you. You are wrong. I incorrect. Incorrect. <laughs> Correct answer is D. Fondness. <laughs> 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 When you to me answer hivi itakuwa aje tukiingia spell the word wacha tugundue ju tunaingia This is the quiz show we are on to our challenge of spell the word we're going to read out a statement pick a word test our contestants on how well they can be able to spell it hopefully correctly leader so far avengers at 700 points Hot on their heels, 600 points is Team Kabisa. You get an opportunity of going fast. Your statement reads as follows. He illustrated his lecture with stories of his own experiences in the field. Spell for me the word illustrated. 
Illustrated. Nancy, let me hear from you. Illustrated. Let's go. I. I. Double L. Double L. U. U. S. S T. T. R. R. A. A. T. T. E. D. Beautiful. Correct. A hundred points. Over to you. Can you make it? Seven hundred. It is possible. Your statement reads as follows. The governess invited them. The governess invited them. The governess. Spell for me, governess. Eh, hey, let me hear from Wangare, governess. Hiya. Turn the cousin. Go. Uh, G. G. O. O. V. V. E. E. R. R. N. N. E. E. Double S. Double S. Good job. Correct. A hundred points. Can you make it 900? The statement reads as follows. They accuse him of committing a sacrilege. Spell for me, sacrilege. Sacrilege. Nelson, let me hear from you. All right, let's go. S. S. A. A. C. C. R. R. L. Sorry, S. Let me begin again. Sorry. Please do. S. S. A. A. C. C. R. R. I. I. L. L. E. E. G. G. E. Correct! A hundred points! Nine hundred points! Can you make it eight hundred? It is possible. Your statement reads as follows. His autobiography was published in 2015. Spell for me autobiography. Kabisa, let me hear from you on this one. Autobiography. A, A U U T T O O B B I I O O G G R R A A P P H H Y Correct! 100 points! Hey! 900 for the Avengers! 800 for Team Kabisa! Who do you think is going to carry the day? Watch a Twitter Leo Iwake Moto. Tweet! Niko standby! Kupoke is a tweet zenu to wonder who's going to carry the day. So far, so good. But to maintain Alita Badilika when we come to guess the logo. Welcome back to the quiz show, where if you know, you know, and if you don't, we confirm it. I sincerely hope by the Una Jibamba. <laughs> While you are learning in the process so far, a tight race and a half. Just to remind you, by the way, you can be able to watch all the episodes of the quiz show on YouTube. Take it, take it. Ah. Changamuka, kabu mehata any episode utaipata pale online. Haya, hasa tuingie haraka faster to our challenge of guess the logo. Lakini hapa tumeeka kajuis kidogo. Kajuis kidogo tumeongeza. We want to show them the slogan of the brand name we are looking for. Eh, kamu ni kram images poleni. Poleni. <laughs> Ineto emergency paper. Poleni. Poleni. <laughs> Hey, hey, mutajua, mutajua. <laughs> so we are going to show you a slogan and I want you to tell me here slogan in a identified na which brand name. We begin with you. The first one is just do it. Nike. <laughs> Nike, Nike. <laughs> Nike. 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 Yes, it is! A hundred points! You are now at one thousand points. Hapo hapo, let me add you another one. Hey, 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 hey. 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 I love to switch. Has it got balanced? Sour. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does. Yeah. 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 Good food, good life. Nancy, which one? Any 
You are the right track. Huh? Fresh. Fresh? Fresh fry. Fresh fry! Would you like to change your answer? No? No. No! Alright? Just in case they are wrong. Top fry. Top fry! <laughs> I like this guy. I like this guy. <laughs> ah, you're fantastic. Yeah, anyway, anyway. <laughs> Beautiful. Nani kama kabisa. The correct answer is. Let's find out. Nestle. <laughs> We're on a top fry. Maintain. <laughs> Over to you. Tell me. Hiya. I will begin with the last one, then Nikuja for the first one. Convict music. Convict music. Econ. You sure? Yes. Would you like to change your answer? No. no. Okay. Is it Econ? Correct! A hundred points! Okay, you guys are now at what? Is it 800? Or 900? 900. 900 points. Nikona kama rada. Higher! Tell me this one! Wasafi. Wasafi records. Madam, you are serious. Yashua, I don't know what to Kabisa. Diamond Platinums. Diamond? Platinums. Alright, is it Diamond Platinums or is it Wasafi Records? Wasafi Records. Wasafi Records. Wasafi Records. Wasafi Records. Okay. Wasafi Records. Diamond Platinums. I don't know. You tell me. Any can do. Kabisa. <laughs> 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 Higher! That makes it a thousand points apiece! We are coming on to a sweet challenge. You guess the price, but just before we do so, Nataka nukupatie chance ya kuingia pale kwa mtandao. Wangalevi tumbili tatu niambie according to you, nani anabeba this contest ya leo? As I take a short commercial break. So we are back from our commercial break. Just before we went on the break, we have the two teams tied at 1,000 points. I don't know how this is going to go because at the time Lianza who pande this time round, I will switch once again and come over to the side here, Team Kapisa. We are getting on to our challenge of guess the price. We are going to give them a product. We expect them to tell us their price, and we are looking for the retail price. Yanini. Supermarket. Here you can discuss, but if you fail to get the correct answer, somebody can snatch 100 points from you. Because our mm. your first product is this one Faraja Premium Tea 250 grams sachet. Faraja Premium Tea 250 grams sachet. Aya, Kabisa Nanikata, I don't know your bay. 250 grams sachet. 120. 120? Can you change your answer? No. Hey, I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. You know, you meant should. Just in case they are wrong. Ben? 85 bob. 85 bob? Would you like to change your answer? Would you? No. No. Okay. You like to depend upon the confidence? The correct price range is anything between 73 Kenya shillings and 80. Uh, Kenya shillings. Tuko karibu. Five bob peke yake. Munge shuka kidogo munge ingia ndani ya super. So far, so good. Over to you guys. Let me figure out if you can tell me this one. Geisha soap, lemon and honey, 225 grams. Mtego iko kwa 225 grams. Geisha soap, lemon and honey, 225 Drops. Okay, then. Fifty. Would you like to change your answer? 
No. <laughs> no. No. Please. No. No. All right, you said it. Just in case. Nancy. 85 bob. 85 bob. 90 apple. Ah ah, wait wait. Would you like to change your answer? No. The correct price range is anything between 80 Kenya shillings and 90 Kenya shillings. <laughs> Correct! <laughs> 100 <laughs> points! The Avengers are back on the lead. Hiya, can you make it an extended lead of 1,200 points? Your product is Daima Thick Yogurt Vanilla 500 ml. Daima Thick Yogurt Vanilla 500 ml. Nelson, Nancy, Gani? 55. 55 bob! Would you change? Najua. Wangare, a hundred bob. One, you have to change your answer. Sticking to it. Okay. The correct price range is anything between 90 Kenya shillings and 100 Kenya shillings. Correct. 100 additional points. It is now officially once again a tie. Over to you guys. Hey, hey. Nestle Milo Active Gold Tin, 400 grams. Nestle Milo Active Gold Tin, 400 grams. Mtihani Eco 400 grams. Can you make this 1,200 points? Nelson, give me your price range. 230. 230. This is Milo, bro. Ah, baby. So I'll go for. Uh... 450 shillings. 450 shillings! You'll thank me later. Hold that thought. Kabisa! 400! Okay? When you mean that's the police come, you want to change your answer. You're sorry, Nasema? No. Higher! Correct price range is anything between 635 Kenya shillings <laughs> and 645 Kenya Bob. Nobody gets a point on that one. We are still tied at 1,100 points. Dugum Tazamaj. According to you, Nani and Abeba, is it Team Avengers or Team Kabisa? Let's find out in the final challenge of back to school. <laughs> what a race. This is the quick show and we are on to our challenge of back to school. We are going to test our contestants of how much they can remember what they learned in school. So far, it is a tight race and a half. Still tied at 1,100 points. I have no option but to start on my left because I began on the other side of my right. I don't know who is going to carry the day. Ladies and gentlemen, we have four subjects, Kiswahili, which is compulsory mathematics science or ict lakini kwanza tunaanza na somo la kiswahili hapa hatuwezi kujadiliana kila mtu atapambana na hali yake <laughs> kwa kila swali nitakuuliza kama hujui jibu tafadhali sema nini pass asante oh, pass peter. pia ni sawa peter peter vivyote vile ningependa nianze naye kwa wakati huu wakati ule mwingine nilianza na <laughs> dada nancy nelson kama uko tayari Ningependa nianze nawe. Uko tayari? Uko tayari. Jibu maamkizi. Jela utu. Eh, rudia. Jibu maamkizi. Jela utu. Peter. Peter, haya. Andika sentence hii kwa wingi. Uwanja mwingine umechimbuliwa kuongezea ule wa zamani. Uwanja nyingine. Uwanja nyingine. Mhm. Mm Zimetambuliwa. Ah, chimbuliwa. Uwanja mwingine Uwanja <laughs> mwingine Umechimbuliwa Umechimbuliwa Kuongezea uh -huh. Ule wazamani 
You one, tell me. Wanja zingine wanja Time is ticking. Wanja zingine zimechambuliwa. Ehe. Kuwa kuongezea. Kuongezea. Ye <laughs> niambie ule wa zamani. Nyanja wanja. Muda wako wa yoyoma. Wanja zingine zimechambuliwa kuwa kama ujui sema tupite. <laughs> ujui asanti. Tofautisha kati ya maneno haya. Shuka na suka. Shuka. Shuka ni kama kuteremka, alafu suka ni kama kusuka nywele. Umepata asanti. Onyesha nomino ya jamii katika sentence ifuatayo. Wageni watatambul, wageni watatumbuizwa na bendi ya Kayamba Afrika. Onyesha nomino ya jamii katika sentence ifuatayo. Wageni watatumbuizwa na bendi ya Kayamba Afrika. Watatumbuizwa. Watatumbuizwa. Watatumbuizwa la hasha. Andika sentence ifuatayo kwa ukubwa. Mwizi huyu alipigwa na mtu. Jizi hili limepigwa na jitu. Nitakupa, nitakupa. Umejaribu sana nitakupa. Ingawa ningependa ungeniambia jizi hili lilipigwa. Lakini umesema limepigwa lakini ni sawa. Nitakupa hilo. Umenangana sana ndugu yangu. Alama mia moja hapo. Haya, pole kwa uh, samhani sana kwa kukosa kuliona swali hili. Swali ambalo nataka kukuuliza ni hili. Andika katika nafsi ya tatu. Wingi wa sijasafiri kwenda Marekani. Wingi wa sijasafiri kwenda Marekani. Ah ah. Pana kupenda jibu. Twende kazi. Hawajasafiri kwenda Marekani. Umepata hawajasafiri kwenda Marekani. Alama mia moja. Ha, haya, mumepata alama ngapi sahihi? Tatu. Mumejiongezea alama mia tatu. Hivi sasa mko na alama elfu moja mia nne. Ningependa nianze nawe dada wangare kama utaniruhusu. Lakini hata usiponiruhusu ndaza nao. <laughs> Huna budi ila kuanza. Swali la kwanza ni hili, jibu maamkizi. Huriani? Kama ujui, muda wako wa yoyoma. Muda wako wa yoyoma. Buheri. Buheri, la hasha umenoa. Kisawe cha neno damu ni ndio. Umepata. Ni vazi lipi kati ya hizi ambalo sina kike? Blauzi shimizi surupwenye rinda. Umepata. Mtoto wa kuzaliwa wa mwisho katika familia anaitwaje? Kifunga mimba ma kitinda mimba. Kitinda mimba umepata. Malipo anayotoa mtu kama shukrani kwa jambo alilotendewa au analotaka kutendewa huitwa marupurupu fidia kinu wa mgongo riba. Kinu wa mgongo. Umepata. Msichana ambaye amebalehe lakini hajaolewa anaitwa nani? Bikra Kapera mwanamwali tasa. Mwanamwali. Umepata. No. 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 Ah. Eh, hey, kweli. Mume jikakamua. Mmepata alama 500 zaidi. Nile peke yake amkupata ni maamkizi buriani kuwajibu buriani dawa. Hivi sasa team kabisa wako na alama 1600. Wamewapiku wenzao ambao sasa wako na alama 1400. Hao ni team Avengers mko na nafasi ya kujichagulia kati ya somo la hesabati sayansi au somo la teknolojia ICT. Lipi? Science. Science. Kabisa let to begin with you. Ready? If yes, you sir. are. Let's finish strong and I hope you will. Yes. On the periodic table what symbol stands for barium? BE. BE incorrect. What is a material that will not carry an electrical charge called? Come again. What is a material that will not carry an, an electrical charge called? Iron. Iron incorrect. What name is given for the number of protons found in the nucleus of an atom? Time is ticking. I don't know. Pass. Pass. All right. What is the most abundant gas in the Earth's atmosphere? Incorrect. Which term describes how living things affect each other and the environment? Pass. Pass. All right. How many teeth does an adult human have? Correct. Hi. <laughs> <laughs>
Wangare ile kwa ngumu. Sana. Oi oi oi. Very I got B E it is B A. So close so uh so near to that one. The material that does not carry electrical charge is an insulator. And then the number that is found uh, the number of protons found in the nucleus is atomic number. <laughs> that was so close. Then we have what is the most abundant gas in Earth's Nitrogen. atmosphere, say it? Nitrogen. Correct. Nitrogen, not oxygen. And the term that describes how living things affect each other and the environment, it is ecology. You guys have gotten um, one, two questions. No, one. Thirty two, my part. So you guys have gotten one question correct. You are now at 1,700 points. Hi. Nancy Nelson, between mathematics and ICT, which one do you pick? ICT. ICT. Yeah. Remember, if you get three questions correct, we have tied up. If you get four, you may just have carried the day. Nancy, I begin with you. Uh, she wants us to change to maths. You, no, you want to change? Math. Okay, math. Math. All right. All right. You said math. Let's do it. Nancy, back to you. I'm sure you have a piece of paper and a pen just in case you need to calculate what type of shape has seven sides. Nancy, this one, no discussion. Everyone is dealing by themselves. All right, what type of shape has seven sides? Pentagon. Pentagon, incorrect. What is pi equals to? Uh, 22 over 7. Correct. There were 500 milliliters of water in a jug and 40 milliliters was poured out. What was the total percentage that was poured out? 40. There were 500 milliliters of water in a jug and 40 milliliters were poured out. What was mm, 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 mm. Uh -huh. what was what was the total percentage that was poured out? Time is ticking. Time is ticking. Say it. Uh, Say it. Pass. Pass. All right. What name is given to a triangle with no equal sides? If you don't know, say pass. What name is given to? What name is given to a triangle with no equal sides? Pass. Pass. All right. How many fours are there in 44? Fours are there. 44. Shh. <laughs> no. How many? Ah, look at me. <laughs> Nancy, look at me. How many fours are there in 44? 11. 11, correct. Okay. <laughs> Can you place the following fractions in order beginning with the smallest? 6 over 9, 1 over 2, 7 over 8, 3 over 5. Come again. Can you place the following fractions in order beginning with the smallest? 6 over 9, 1 over 2, 7 over 8, 3 over 5. Beginning with the smallest. Smallest to the largest. Uh, 7 over 8. 7 over 8. Uh, 3 over 5. 3 over 5. 2 over 3. 2 over 3, there's no yeah. 2 over 3, sir. Oh, sorry, 6 over 9. 6 over 9? And uh, a half, 1 over 2. And 1 over 2? Yes. All right. Correct. <laughs> How many points is it a tie? 1, 2, 3 questions correct, 300 additional points. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, it is a tie at 1,700 points. <laughs> what type of shape has seven sides? It's a, it's a heptagon. And of course, the answer that I wanted was 8%. And a triangle with no equal sides is a scalene triangle. Now we are going into a tie breaker. I am going to ask you questions in the ICT. The first team to go. Yes, the opportunity of snatching this one. Sudden death, we call it. Go first. My studio team is on standby to tell me who goes first. Final chance for you, dear audience. Send your tweet. Is it Team Kapisa carrying this one? 
or the Avengers? First question. In a website browser address bar, sorry, in a website browser address bar, what does www stand for? World Wide Web. World Wide web. web. Who went first? Who went first? Who went first? Avengers went first? Okay, studio says Avengers went first. Why? We can clearly see you look like that guy. No, 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 you see. They are saying we are cooking something. Uh, I only <laughs> take instructions from the studio team. I don't know. Who do you think uh. said it first? But so far, by the verdict of my studio team, Team Avengers carry the day. <laughs> 1,100 <laughs> points. God, these guys are good. What a tight race. I don't know who got it correct. But my brothers, you guys, you guys are awesome. <laughs> You guys are awesome. Mangare, awesome job. Man, Kabisa. Yes, sir. You guys are sharp. Experience in the quad. That's nice. Wow. Hey, Mumu Pelekan. Mangare, Moto, Kama Pasi. Mukini Patia Timmy did a Kama Idi. Mini Takua Sara. What do you want to Pelekan? Beautiful goal job. Beautiful job, guys. I celebrate you. My winners, please come and join me here. Nelson, <laughs> you can come here. <laughs> Woo! How do you feel? Did you expect your win to carry the day, by the way? No. It was so tight. And I knew how she will. She's such a chop. She's oh. all. <laughs> She's a chop, eh? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Nelson, yes. experience in the question. I like these guys, by the way. Very competitive. Yeah, very competitive, guys. Awesome show. I've loved it. Ladies and gentlemen, to participate on the show, only send us an SMS to the number double two triple nine. And let's continue this conversation online at Freddy Buddha Boss or Buddha Boss Live to Tapatana Pali to Tese Kutesa. Every Wednesday and Thursday, the quiz show only on Switch TV. As Pake, you decide how we close the show. <laughs> Nelson, finally, yeah. Fungiaji, Amua. Goma kutotoa si. Goma kutotoa. Cheza ngoma tukienda. Twende wa. Twende tuweji bamba tuweji nataka kuchimba. Toa mtu. Ora. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a rap. Vanyo life tukiondoka.